Right, good morning everyone. Bob here from Greybeard Models. Um, first thing I'd like to say, I hope everybody over there in the US uh, hasn't been affected too much by the snow. Um, fortunately here in the UK it's fairly mild, so it's, it's not too bad. Um, just wanted to do a quick update on the group build, on the, the small scale car group build. And uh, this is the the truck that I'm building, the 1934 Model A. Um, it's a really neat little kit, actually. I'm really quite quite chuffed with it. Um, the chassis is okay. That's all cleaned up, all right. There's a bit of sink marks and ejection pin marks in the, in the underside here, but it's the underside, so it should be okay. So that's that's all cleaned now, and that's ready for paint. Um, in fact, let's bring this over. Um, a lot of the parts now are ready for paint. The rear body, uh, you know, the pickup bed. Um, I had to sort out some ejection pin marks in there, but uh, give that a blast the primer to see if that's if that's come over, out okay. So that that'll be interesting to see what happens with that. Um, temporarily fix the tailgate onto the the rear end there. Uh, just so that I can get it primed and and sorted out. There's ejection pin marks in the back there, but I think I've, I've got rid of those, but I'll give it a blast the primer to find out. Um, the front part, the chassis, front end, yeah, that's all ready for paint. And that's the, the transmission, that's ready for primer and paint. So everything's getting stuck onto the wheel. These other parts here are from um, from the Catalina build that I'm doing. That's that one out of the way there. Um, the rear of the cab body on the pickup is um, it was okay. Horrible seam here, so I've tried to get rid of that. Um, so I'll give that a blast of primer. I think I'm going to have to rework the top edge there as well. Um, inside, there's no detail inside which is a bit disappointing um, so I'm gonna have to <laughs> I, I wasn't gonna build do too much detail on this one I thought I'd just do it as a quick out of the kit out of the box build but um, yeah I'm gonna have to do some internal details for the doors um, if I didn't do that I think my brother would shoot me uh, the uh, dash for this yeah it's okay fairly plain but it will do the job for this particular kit. Um, the windscreen, um, out, you know, the frame is had some really nasty ejection pin marks on there, so I've filled those and sanded those back. Um, these parts here all get black primer and a coat of chrome. I'll get those in the shot, including the radiator. But I'm going to use the radiator to um, get the two halves of the hood together get everything lined up properly um, I'll use some blue tack to hold everything in place and get everything lined up and then glued solid so that's all coming together quite nicely so I'm quite pleased with that I mean all, all the things with this kit um, they're, they're things that are, that are tricky but you know, we should be able to work our way around these things. They shouldn't be too much of a problem. But the, the main disappointment was the seat. <laughs> now, according to the box art, let's move that out of the way. According to the box art, the seat's got a diamond pattern upholstery on it. Um, the seat in the kit came with no upholstery, just plain seats. And also, it didn't come far enough back, um, if I take that out, um, within the cab shell, um, it, it didn't come far enough back. Um, it, it sort of left a huge gap here. So, what I've done here is um, use some milliput. I've put a coat in a milliput over it. It's... Um, it's all set off now which is really good 
so what I should do now is that that's about the right position for it now um, the next thing to do will be to mimic the the diamond pattern in the upholstery so I'll do that by by scribing the pattern into this um, so that's that's my next big job on this um, once all that's done then I think pretty much everything's ready for paint so anyway that's an update on that um, it's great being part of this build I'm really in, really enjoying doing these group builds so thank you to everybody to uh, you know to invite me along it's really good so thank you very much and uh, stay safe out there everyone and uh, I'll see you again and see you again soon cheers bye bye